Spring Fling is back in Spartanburg starting today and going through the weekend. The festival kicks off with the fastest night in the Berg. 7 News is Christine Scarpelli live again in downtown Spartanburg where the wind is blowing. Whoa. <laughs> the wind is blowing, Fred, that's for sure. Yeah, I can't imagine being on a bike like Hudson. Check them out. These kiddos are going to be racing tonight as well. Spring Fling, guys, big deal happening this weekend. It's the biggest party in Spartanburg. Friday, Saturday, Sunday, live music and food, entertainment. There's vendors. Yeah. Right? Just all the, the cranks. All the food, all the drinks. So yeah. he's back with us talking about the Criterium race, just like Hudson. How many racers? How many do we have ish? In the, the big kids mm -hmm. race or the little kids race? Oh, that's true. Kiddos. <laughs> Let's talk kiddos first. Just like Hudson, how many kids do we yeah, have? Yeah, right? gosh, about 150 kids. Oh, I didn't know it was that much. It is our biggest year ever. <laughs> you this told race me it was big, has but... gained popularity year after year, and so it's become like a staple of the criterion. Oh, I'm, yeah. I'm really impressed. Yeah. I thought it was a couple dozen, maybe. And you know okay. what? They go the whole loop that the professionals do. So, so fun. it's awesome to see. Okay, so that starts at about three o'clock with some of those amateur races, right? Is it the, kiddos? the kids race is at five, Kay. so they're kind of half time. Okay. Um, amateur races start at three. Nice. Yes. Get here this afternoon. Uh, I think Malachi, our meteorologist, has said no rain, so I appreciate that. We got the rain holding off for you. Yes. But um, there will be some fast nights, fast speeds. I think a lot of these racers are on kind of a circuit. So they will they did Greenville yesterday, now they're here riding tonight, uh, and they'll be moving on and doing these races day after day. But this is serious. I mean, they want to go pretty fast tonight, right? Yeah, absolutely. Anywhere from 25 to 30 miles per wow. hour, they'll be cruising around these turns. Very so. good. If you yeah. don't have a tent, you see some tents there behind us. Some businesses and organizations have purchased them to tailgate. Yep. in a fun way. If you don't have a tent though, where do you go, Sophie? You can go to Freight Yard to see the races live. There are some bleachers on Church Street you can hang out at. Um, there are a lot of local businesses that will have their doors open, so if you want to grab a coffee and watch the races, you can do that. Um, so how about learning more about PAL? Yeah, absolutely. So this event is hosted by and benefiting PAL, Play Advocate Live Well. Um, and we are working to make Spartanburg a healthier, more active place through building trails and um, incorporating healthier food into the local food system. I'm just watching Hudson. He's making me a little <laughs> nauseous. He's, He's riding in the circle. He's going so fast. You can see Hudson and his friends. He will be competing tonight, so you can cheer Hudson on. If you're watching viewers, now you've got a reason to come on out and enjoy the Criterium tonight. Fred, we have had a ball this morning. Hasn't this been impressive? It's really cool, although I'm getting, oh my God, I'm getting dizzy it? just watching him go in circles. Are I you? hope he's doing okay. Thank you, he's Christine. So well. See you oh next half God. hour. 822 is the time. That's a live look at downtown Spartanburg. Streets blocked off for spring playing. You're watching 7 News. Now let's check out your sports lineup. You'll see it this weekend here on the 62 and